All right, welcome back to our next video guys today we're going to go through how to actually obtain an official artist channel on youtube so there is two ways that i know of there is more but these are the two sure ways you can go straight through youtube or you can use distrokid um the criteria between the two platforms varies so i'm going to go through both of them so it can be easily understood by you guys all right so once you're an artist and you have been releasing music on youtube and you need an official artist channel this is very important and the criteria are quite simple once you meet these criteria the application process should be done in less than 15 minutes and you can have an official artist channel in at least three weeks ready to go so without further ado we're going to go on a computer and going to show you how you can obtain an official artist channel using both method destructed and straight through youtube all right so don't forget to like comment share and subscribe if you find the information useful let's go on the computer so the most important thing when it comes on to applying for the official artist channel is to ensure that you meet the criteria for whoever you're using to apply for the, the official artist channel whether it be destructed or it be youtube so i'm going to focus on just youtube right now and then afterwards i'll do the destructed because i know that not everybody distribute with destructed so these are the criteria for youtube one you need to own and operate a youtube channel that represents an artist or band almost everybody have a youtube channel so you must have one all right so if we can tick that off we have a youtube channel number two have at least three official releases on youtube delivered and distributed by a music distributor or a label you cannot get an official artist channel if you don't have a distributor all right and when they said delivered and distributed by um, a music distributor it simply means that it must have a topic channel all right and i'm going to show you what a topic channel is once i jump on youtube okay so if you have been releasing with a distributor zojak happy loss distracted whoever it is you must have a topic channel so we can tick this off so we meet two criteria so far next have no policy violation on your channel copyright strike is all right but no policy violation so nothing derogatory and i need no no heavy fine or anything like that your channel is up to standard you follow the rules and regulation of youtube so we can say boom we tick that off so we have two of them here and we're good to go however you need to have one of these and this is probably one of the hardest thing to get which is work with a youtube partner manager or be a part of a youtube partner program your channel is part of a label network your music is distributed by a music partner listed to music service partners all right so most of us are as artists our producers we normally try to be a part of the youtube partner program which is when your channel is monetized and to be a part of that program you need to have at least 1000 subscribers and 4000 watch hours so that is what you want to aim with a youtube channel ensure you have those requirements and once you have those requirements you're good to go all you have to do is just submit an email to support artists at youtube.com i'm going to send it, show you the email and everything so it will be easy for you and they can have your, your official artist channel in less than three weeks so so these are the requirements guys all right so now let's jump on youtube let me show you what exactly what i was talking about so let me see youtube So this is a topic channel guys, um, th this is how it looks. So it is provided to you by Zojak Worldwide, um, it gives you the name, uh, the, the instrumental, the producer, you know, and it's auto generated. So yeah, the topic channel is something like this. So whenever you're submitting the email to YouTube, you're going to want to look for your topic channel. So you can just type in your artist name dash topic and you will find a topic channel. All right. So this. All of these are listed on my topic channel these are um these are s instrumentals that i have released before through you through zojak but they've uploaded to youtube underneath the topic channel all right so that is it next let me show you the email now that we're gonna create 
So you want your email to look something like this. All right, so here's the official email, artist-support at youtube.com. That's the email you want to send um, the email to once you have meet all the criteria. So you want to include a name. So my name is Dash and I'd like to upgrade my channel to an official artist channel. I am hoping you can help me out. I'll have all the necessary information. Artist name. You can put a label name. It's not important, but you can if you want. So the artist name, the operated channel, which this is your main channel. All right. So remember, you're going to have a YouTube channel and you're going to have a topic channel. So the main channel would have been... Um, this which is my youtube channel so all i do i just go here my channel and i copy the link all right and in the email you would paste it so the operated channel so that is the main channel next you look for your topic channel so we go here and research our oxygen music topic and you look for the look for one that is on your topic channel here is one and you copy this as well you come back in the email and beside the topic channel you paste it all right so that is the that is the main channel and this is a topic channel and below this all i need to do is just list at least three songs that you have released so i can put back um the wells fargo rhythm here i think i have a next one this ultra rhythm just look for three songs that you have released on youtube that's on your topic channel and not on youtube on whatever distributor you have and you can add them to the email just a link so it can be easier for them to process it for you even if you don't add it here when you submit this email they they are going to ask you for those information all right so you put the link to three official releases here that they have released before um the album art is not recommended and the vivo channel is not recommended you don't need to have those but just in case you do have a vivo you can put it there so they can merge it so they're gonna merge the youtube channel they're gonna merge the topic channel and they're gonna merge the vivo channel so this is what your email should look like whenever you're submitting it to support so they can process it for you so once you submit this email they will get back to you and the email should look something like this um, i think i have it support um so this is the actual email that you were talking about um they say thanks for your response good news i have submitted your request and it will take some time to perform quality assurance and then upgrade the channel to oce which is official artist channel and it just gives some some um props or some pros to official artist channel and i can give them some time for them to process it all right and then they will get back to you and let you know that look it has been successful and your, your, your channel is now officially an artist channel okay so that is it that's all you have to do to to apply for an official artist channel through the youtube way all right so now let's jump over to using this kid this truck is a bit simpler and like youtube they do have their criteria that need to be met so let's go to this truck so these are this truck um criteria one make sure you already have an cha art a channel dedicated to your content as an artist which you would have already make sure your artists have at least one release so contrary to um so YouTube, which asks for three, this your kids say you need to have at least one, which is good. So if you only have one or two song releases, you still can go ahead and get an official artist channel. Okay, so this is for this your kid. And number three, you need to follow these instructions and then you can proceed. So let me jump over this your kid. Or let's, yeah, let me use this your kid. So it, hold on, let me see what it says. It's a um, select goodies menu upper right, select special guests special access sorry and then select youtube official artist channel i doubt i'm gonna have access to this because i'm not listed as an official artist on this this circuit because you know i don't release music on this circuit um no it's not there but this this is where you would have gone so you go to goodies special access official artist channel all right and then you you would follow the instruction that they give here um, select the artist you want to associate with your account authenticate into your youtube account claim your channel and that's done so this is the only reason i can't go beyond here because i'm not an artist on this circuit 
I'm only listed as a producer where I get a split of the masters and distro kit. So as you can see, it's only the master split here for the producer, not the not the artist. So I can't go any further there. But just follow these instructions. I'm gonna list them down in the description if you're using distro kit. And all you have to do is select the artist you want to associate with the channel. Once you have a distro kit, the most the artist should be there. And then you authenticate into your YouTube account. They're gonna make you log into YouTube from DistroKid, claim the channel, and that's done. You give them some time, then process it, and that's all I have to do, guys. So it's quite simple. All you need to do is ensure that you meet these criteria. Once you meet the criteria, you send the email, and the email is done. I'm also gonna prepare the email in the description so you, you can just copy it and paste it. Fill in what you need to fill in your information and send it off to, to um support. And that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you have a wonderful day.